ball a little bit. But he's got a big arm over the top right over the top with most of his to just keep this game in check and now it's going to be late inning dramatics by somebody. It's Miguel Cabrera. Jamer Candelario and Eric Haas. Swung on and missed. It's two and one to Cabrera. Fouled away. Since the All Star break in the last series in Detroit, mm -hmm. had some scary moments, but he worked his way out of it. And flip it back and forth three times to make sure the Velcro sticks perfect. I'm going to do the same thing and annoy everybody that's watching the game because it can delay it. Help. Seems to work for him though. And he strikes yeah. out Cabrera to start the seventh. Well, it's been working for a while, right? First pitch is up high. It's 11 strikeouts for Tigers hitters now. He went and it's one and one. Here's what the Guardians bullpen has done since the head into the last month and a half. I think the big question people have in Cleveland in the last couple weeks of the season. And the pitching gives you a chance, that's for sure. High fly ball right field for Oscar Gonzalez. And there are two away. Down to Trevor Thompson. Trev. I see you're working. Trev, you, you are not a you must, might, you're not he a might be the guy. 20, 27th man though, Shep. He yeah. might not make the roster to the all dressed chips. I have not. All dressed chips are awesome too, but I like my dogs the same way. I all dressed. Of, you know what I gotta be honest with you. I'm, I'm kind of stuck in habit. Come French on. fries. Yeah. I, you, you should never have even put ketchup on the table when steak is served, right? You can't do that. How hilarious is that though? Uh, that Sent is, down to the minors. That, that's a good way to. And, and not double A, not triple A, all the way down to single A. The birthday boy. Two and two to Eric Haas. Foul back. He battles. And, and pause just will not break. Have not gotten a word out of pause in no, all my years of America. Can't do that. A little high, hits a full count. Walked him. Good bat. Good battle. Preach. Indeed, Talk indeed. it into existence. Will Why you? not? Will it to happen? There's the hanger. <laughs> you only get part Come of on, the equation. Swung on and missed. It's a 95 mile an hour. Inning over. A couple of strikeouts by Karen Check. Tigers leave one. We year at Texas Tech. And wall side windows pitching change with the smooth fielding shortstop. He played his college ball at Oklahoma. Cody Clemens played it, but then the work has to begin. One and two now to Cody Clemens. And then One two to Clemens couldn't hold up strikes out to start the seventh. And I have on on the young kids that sign kids in college that sign like a Jace Young they have more to learn their body has to have to mature. Mm -hmm. Where college kids are a little bit closer or an Isaac Pacheco who no your first year right any level at pro ball. Not taking anything away from what Padua can work his way on base again. Instead, he strikes yes. out. Back-to-back -back strikeouts for Karen Check. Takes it low. Green struck out looking in the fifth, but it was a high. Spins it in there for a strike, and it's one and one. Swung on and missed. It's one and two to Riley Green. 
Karen check strikes out the side on 12 pitches. Tigers go in. Reason to come out. Tigers even a better reason. Victor Reyes, Javier Baez, and Willie Castro for Detroit here in the eighth. Sixth. That's where we stand now. Fouls it back. Karen Check is in his second inning. He struck out the Tigers side in the seventh on 12 pitches. The whole hesitation thing. Fastball at 94 is low. It was the fastball, but it was high and away. A leadoff walk for Victor Reyes. Javi do some damage on a mistake pitch. There's the curveball, 0 and 1. He's about to say, and if he does, that's when it's not. <laughs> Way out in front. Back to back curve. Outside, 1 and 2. Setting their rhythm and time. Reaches out a line drive to second, but not in time. There goes Reyes. The throw from Maley. Didn't get him. That's up and in. Three and oh. I ball a couple of them. In there for a strike. Oh my. Wow. Now three and two. Strike three. Got him looking. Jeez. That bounces away from Maley. Reyes will take third. Up high, one and one. Two and one. Three and one to Kerry Carpenter. Good fastball hitter, too. Inside, and he walked him. There goes Elvis. Throw to third. Safe. The infield in. Oh, and two. High and tight, and Josh just got out of the way. One, two. Harrison in the air, short right field. Benson, the rookie underneath, and no tag from Elvis. The throw is high and knocked down. Here comes Elvis. He's on his way, and he scores. Oh, what a read. Elvis. Fouled away by Pollock. Whatever it is, I mean, it's still a very young player making a mistake that was very costly. That's the type of play that keeps you in a race, though. You know what I mean? You... He's five runs short of a thousand in his career as AJ pumps this ball to the left and Quan keeps his feet to make the catch. A rare wobble by Cleveland. Elvis Andrews spring. Fastball misses inside to Trent Grisham, who is 0 for 2 tonight, struck out twice. Meanwhile, for Grisham, he's 2 for. High with the fastball, 2 and 1. When you talk about Savali, 
you know, Nola hit the ball hard, but he hustled to get into second base, so it wasn't yeah. a traditional. 80% coming into that at bat, getting him home with less than two outs. He bunted at it and it fouled back into the seat, so he strikes out. Thank you what very in much. The world. Thank wow. You. Thank you. Curveball strike. Well, that one split the plate in half. Yeah, he's got the curveball working now. And now two and two. Never seen anybody quite like James Karinchek either. You should hear the conversation. Oh, I'm listening. <laughs> Ron drive to center field, and Austin Nola has his second hit of the night. Tying run aboard. Jerks and Profar coming up. High curveball, one row to Jerks and Profar. Hit by a pitch in the first inning. He singled in the right field in the third and then ground. And all of a sudden the low stroke uh, low strike position. But he did. Well wow, even Profar thought I was going to get called. Ball one. The one one. Out of play. The one two. I don't know, Rick. He must have been guessing because that looked like a uh, yeah. very hittable fastball. Well, it was. You'd want to get at. Popped him up. Mm -hmm. He made it. He got it. Makes the catch, and a heck of a job by James Karinchek to get out of some. See Baltimore takes the dub to nothing. Now the Orioles aren't going away, that's for sure. Foster this year. Talked about the merit. Crawford lays off the big curve. So Karinchak issues the first walk of the night from Haggerty bunts that foul. And that ball also hit him in the process. Haggerty thinks he should be awarded first base, but he Haggerty squares, the bunt is popped up foul. That bat. Fastball swing and a miss as Haggerty strikes out on a high heater third time. Fastball is in there, a strike from Korinchak. Had a good cut at that fastball. That and he does. High fastball strikes out Julio Rodriguez. Third time Rodriguez is one for three tonight with a base hit. That's when bullpen guys are really ha! able to use the situation to their advantage. One ball, one strike on Wink. Winker hits that one right into our booth. All and then replay. <laughs> 0 for one, buddy. Not a over one. Lane. 
Winker lays off the high fastball. Right three. The curve is in there. Strike three called, and Winker doesn't like it. A curveball at the top of the zone.